when you look back at this piece, what, what were some of the almost biggest challenges for you in, in working on this piece? How do you make a foot out of a tube of straw? <laughs> How do you like make it uh, strong enough? Because at first I was thinking, it's straw, it's just gonna go like this and fall over. But uh, like, and I think we probably over sewed it because I was nervous about if it was gonna hold itself. And so we sewed this thing so much and it was super strong. So, but I didn't know and I, and I think uh, I think I was pleased with how much I could form the straw because I, it's messy stuff that falls apart and it's like how do you make a toe out of this stuff and make it hold together. So, but, um, so I learned a lot that way and it made me very excited to do something out of mud where you don't have to fire it because firing changes the piece and to me this is way more what I made than actually my fired pieces are. Because when the firing it shrinks or it distorts a little bit, whereas this is what I, what I made, it, and it gets to stay that way, and that's pretty cool.